Hello and Happy New Year. Welcome to SCLC TV 2019. I'm Maynard Eaton and of course our President and CEO, Dr. Charles Steele Jr. Dr. Steele, January, we always celebrate Dr. King's birthday. Uh, this month would have been his 90th birthday, but some say there was no piece of cake being SCLC President for him, nor is there a piece of cake for you today. Is no, it's tough. It's a tough job, uh, Maynard. Uh, many people don't realize uh, the existence uh, in relationship to my book is easier to attain than it is to maintain. Uh, people take things for granted and um, we have to stay on the case and you can't do things the way you did them uh, back in the 50s and the 60s. We know we can do those type of things like march, demonstrate, and you got to have a structure. Even when People of today, and I don't like to get into the generation gap. As far as I'm concerned, people are people. I don't get into the millennia and this one and that one and the, and the older. I'm talking about folks because we all must come together, work together. We don't demonstrate protests in a structured manner. Structure comes from God. You're talking about order. But Dr. King was not necessarily universally liked either. Uh back when he was president and certainly by the time he was assassinated but his speech at Riverside Baptist Church uh, kind of dissed him from many of the others in the civil rights movement. Absolutely and including people of color uh, because of the system and the system had their group regardless of the ethnicity uh, when I say group they had people of color as well as others who opposed Dr. King because the system was built like that. It, 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 it was not made to interact and it still is not with poor people. Dr. King was killed for two reasons. His speech at Riverside Church in New York, April the 4th, 1967. A year later, April the 4th, 1968, he was assassinated. So this country never cared about poor people even to today. They talk about the working class, the middle class. But what about the majority of the people that go to work every day are poor people? They are afraid to use the term. Why? Because the system has not been inclusive about it and not embraced it. So as we look at uh, January 2019, uh, Dr. King's 90th birthday, how do you feel sitting in his seat? I feel- Leading this organization. I feel uh, fortunate, blessed. Uh, I feel uh, very significant in the fact that I have a role to play and many times people don't see the role simultaneously because as a leader you got to have a vision. See I don't look around the corner. Other folks are still trying to get to the corner. I know what's around the corner. I know what it takes. Nothing can take away from the visionarium having a relationship with God. We are the Southern Christian Leadership Conference and we need to act like that. But I have an individualized relationship with God. Also though, I've heard you say before, it's toughest part of this job is raising money. Absolutely. Uh, if you're not supposed to be in the position because people don't give with money, with organization with corporate with with a foundation they don't give to organizations they give to leadership thank you for your leadership that's dr charles Steele jr this is sclc tv see you next week